Thank you for joining me today as we go over adult swab collections. You will need just a few items for your swab collections. You will need a collection tube, your swabs, an alcohol swab to wipe down the outside of your tube with, water to rinse your mouth out with, and then either a box or plastic bag to put your sample into while it's stored in the freezer. 10 minutes prior to collection, you'll want to rinse your mouth out with water. You'll swish water around your mouth as you would with mouthwash and then spit into a cup or sink or swallow depending on your preference. You do not want to eat or drink anything prior to your collection. When you're ready to collect, you'll first grab your tube. If your tube is pre-labeled, make sure that you're selecting the tube with the correct label. If it's not labeled, you'll take your labels that you were given, select the right label, and place it on the tube so that the barcode runs lengthwise along the tube. You'll notice that your tube is broken up into three parts. You have the cap, you have what we call the basket, this is where your swab will sit, and you have the main tube component. You want to make sure that the label is only on the main tube component part and not up so far that it runs along the basket part as well. For your collection today, you'll want to make sure that the basket is in the tube and that you're only taking off the cap. When you're ready to collect, again, you'll take your tube and then take your swab. You'll open up your swab and then place it underneath your tongue. Your study instructions should tell you how long to keep it underneath your tongue. You should be careful not to bite or chew on the swab, as this could affect how much your swab can absorb. After uh, enough time has elapsed, you'll want to either with clean hands, take your swab and put it into the basket of the tube, or using your tongue, gently guide the swab from underneath your tongue into the tube. At this point, you can recap your tube, you can take an alcohol swab and wipe down the outside of the tube to remove any saliva that might have spilled out. Take your tube and then place it either into your box or a plastic bag and immediately into the freezer. You'll then want to wash your hands thoroughly. Thank you again for joining me today for swab collections. If you have any further questions, feel free to reach out to your study contact or email us at iisbr at uci.edu. Thank you.